birth of Christ is one that is clothed in simplicity. The events that took place that night were hardly even noticed by most of the people of that time. Only a few truly experienced the joy, the blessing, which was to eventually change the world. No man has ever altered the course of human history or molded the minds of mankind as did the man called Jesus. Tonight, we of Hanover Lutheran Church are honored to be able to share with you this simple yet inspiring and life-changing story. This is the story of the birth of Jesus, the Christ, the Savior of the world. Here is the story. It all began 2,000 years ago, when in those days, Caesar Augustus, who was emperor, issued a decree that a census should be taken to the entire Roman world and everyone went to his hometown to register. Bethlehem in Judea, the birthplace of David. He went with Mary, who was pledged to be married to him, and who was expecting a child. Together, they went to register. While they were in Bethlehem, the time came for Mary to have her baby. But because so many people had arrived in Bethlehem, all the rooms in the inn were full. Joseph tried to find a room, but none were available. But there was a stable which offered shelter. So that is where they stayed, in a stable. Mary's time came to have the baby. And she gave birth to her firstborn son and wrapped him in swaddling clothes and laid him in a manger. And they named the baby Jesus.
now in some nearby fields, there were some shepherds who were spending the night watching over their flock. And an angel of the Lord appeared to the shepherds, and the glory of the Lord shone over them. The shepherds were terribly afraid, but the angel said to them, Fear not, for behold, I bring you good news, which shall be a great joy to all people. Today, in the town of David, a Savior has been born to you. He is Christ the Lord. And this is what will prove it to you. You will find a baby wrapped in swaddling clothes and lying in a manger. heavenly host appeared with the angel, praising God and saying, Glory to God in the highest and on earth, peace to men on whom his favor rests. The announcement of the birth of Jesus, the King of Kings and Savior of all people then went out, not to heads of state or to royalty or nobility, but to shepherds. After being told of the birth of Jesus, the shepherds said, let us go to Bethlehem and see this thing that has happened, which the angels have made known to us. 